Hey everyone, my name is Riley, and this video is a complete Zoho Campaigns review. We will be taking a look at the pricing and the features of Zoho Campaigns, and even comparing it to some other email marketing tools to figure out if you should actually be using Zoho Campaigns, or if there is a better alternative on the market. To get started with Zoho Campaigns, I will leave my affiliate link in the description of this video, so you can scroll down and click on that link. It should be this link right here. It's going to take you over to Zoho campaigns right here and you can get started with your free account by entering your details and then clicking on sign up for free. Now with that being said the first thing that I need to talk about when it comes to Zoho campaigns is the pricing because oh my word this is absolutely incredible. Essentially, when it comes to Zoho, and they do this for absolutely everything, all of the software that they have, whether it be Zoho CRM or Zoho Books, their accounting software, they just do everything for so, so cheap. And it's absolutely crazy. Just as a comparison, the only two email marketing tools that I recommend is Zoho Campaigns and MailerLite. I just don't think any of the other email marketing tools compare to these. And just to show you the pricing difference between MailerLite, which is from all of the email tools that I have found and I have used, MailerLite is the second cheapest. And look at the pricing difference right here. So if I say, let's say 1,000 contacts, right? £4.20, this is probably like $5 in US. Whereas if we compare this to MailerLite, $13. Okay, so it's not crazy different right here, but look what happens when we bump this up to 10,000 contacts. Let's say $35 maybe on Zoho campaigns. 10,000 contacts, $65. So it's just, it's crazy, crazy cheap. We can bump this up even more. And each time the pricing difference, the more email subscribers we get, the bigger it's going to be. MailerLite, $125 for 20,000 subscribers. Zoho campaigns, $50 for the same amount of subscribers. So it is just so incredibly cheap. And what you would expect with an email marketing tool that is cheap is you would kind of expect it to suck, right? But Zoho Campaigns really doesn't. The only downside that I would say to Zoho Campaigns is the user interface is not as nice as other email marketing tools. Like the user interface that you are going to see right here, it's not bad by any stretch of the imagination. We can go over here and we can create an email campaign. And if I go to create campaign right here, and we choose like a regular email, you can see that the user interface is okay. Whereas if I compare this to something like MailerLite, you can see that the overall user interface and the way that this feels and looks, MailerLite just feels newer and it feels more up to date and it's just more fun to use. Now, is that worth the price difference between these? Certainly not. I definitely wouldn't say that it's worth spending almost double the money, especially when you get to those higher amount of email subscribers. I wouldn't say it's worth the money for that because the most important thing really when it comes to an email marketing tool aside from price is how professional the email actually looks. So if I go to create a regular email, something that I really like about Zoho campaigns is the templates that they have. And the templates that they have are a lot better than some other email marketing providers that are a lot more expensive. So if I go into pre-designed templates right here, these are some of the templates that we can get with Zoho campaigns. Now they look absolutely fantastic. In my opinion, they don't quite look as good as MailerLite. And this is one of the main reasons that I actually recommend MailerLite because of these templates and how professional it looks. But is it worth it to pay extra money to get access to these better templates? I'm not sure. It's That's up to you to decide. But there is like a clear difference in the quality between the templates that we can get on MailerLite and Zoho Campaigns. With that being said, I mean, the only reason that MailerLite's templates are better is because MailerLite is just such a good email marketing tool. If I compare this to something like, uh, let's say ConvertKit, which is another email marketing tool, the pricing is pretty crazy, first of all. So for like 10,000 subscribers, we are going to be paying $100 per month. Whereas with Zoho campaigns, we pay like $35 per month for the same amount of contacts. It's crazy. But if I go in and I show you the ConvertKit template right here, we have like maybe 12 templates to choose from, and they are not even as good as the Zoho templates. So essentially what I'm saying is that Zoho campaigns is absolutely incredible in terms of the quality and the templates that you get 
for the price. The only email marketing software that is better than this in terms of the templates that you get and also the user interface is going to be MailerLite but it is more expensive, so it might not be worth it to most people. You need to make that choice for yourself. But if I go in, we can go into the campaigns right here, for example, I can select this template and we have a drag and drop editor. So if I want to go in and I want to type anything in here, I can do that. If I want to change the images, I just click in and change them on this left-hand side. If I grab an image right here, I can drag this to wherever I want to on the template. And this is pretty standard. Every email marketing software out there has a drag and drop template just like this. Honestly, the functionality of a drag and drop template doesn't change much between email marketing tools. So this is just fantastic for the price that you pay. I mean, aside from that, you have everything else that you need inside of an email marketing tool. So we can go down and we can see all of the contacts that we have on our email list. We can add new contacts and we can import them from maybe another email marketing tool. If we are moving over, you can import a file. So if you have your emails listed out on a spreadsheet, you can drop them into here or you can type them out one by one. For any of this, by the way, I created a full tutorial showing you step by step how to use Zoho campaigns, how you can import contacts, how you can create one of these emails step by step with the template and everything else that you need. So if you do want to watch that video, I will leave that down in the description. Uh, we can go to automation as well. So this is where we can set up an automation workflow. And this is where we can create an email marketing autoresponder. So if I just take a look at this template right here, we can see that somebody enters into this when they fill out a landing page. So they give me the email on the landing page and then we send them a message. We wait one hour, then we send them another message. And then if you want to use this template, we can continue with this. So we can go through and we can choose from any of these or alternatively, we can go up, just call this some random name and we can design this entire thing ourselves. So essentially we would just go into here and the first thing that we would select is a trigger. So we can say when somebody enters a form, like they type their email address into my landing page, we can then go down and choose what happens next. So I could go into actions, select an email right here and drop that in. Then I would just click on create and go through and create that email. And then I can go in and maybe add a delay to this. So I say we will wait for two days. And then after two days, we can come in here and send another email and then we can just continue it like this. So this is taking the standard email that we created earlier, where we just send a one-off email. And in here, we are creating a sequence where somebody comes in and we are creating these emails once and then sending them out on autopilot to create an email marketing autoresponder. We can also see reports inside of Zoho campaigns. Uh, I don't think I'll see anything as this is a new account, but essentially this is just going to show you the stats of all of the emails you have created, like how many emails you have sent, how many of them have been opened, how many people clicked on the link. So if you add a link to go to another website or a product in your email, it will tell you how many people click through. Once again, this is nothing special. You get this with every other email marketing tool out there. But as I said, like for the price, you really can't go wrong with Zoho campaigns. So that is my Zoho campaigns review. If you found this video valuable, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.